Hey guys, and welcome to the next episode of Dear Question. Oh, God. It's been a while. It's been a while. Where you been? How are you? What's, uh, what's going on? Don't know why it's been a while. I just haven't done one in a while. Um, something that I want to talk about uh, while we're sort of in the preliminary stuff is um, I'm actually playing Planet Side 2. I've not shown you guys any of it. But I'm actually going to be going back to Planet Side 2 a little bit more, so you may see some content on that. So uh, that's just for you guys who have been missing it. Um, I don't know whether I'll go back to Death Watch. I kind of want to, but I'd need to devote more time to the game. But as soon as I get more time for it, I will be doing uh, Planet Side 2 content because a lot of guy, well, a lot of people enjoyed those videos. People who watched them, I did this uh, interesting style on them. So I hope you look forward to that. Um, Still accepting artwork, so you can always send it to the uh, email generationhollow at gmail.com. It'll be on screen in the description. So if you get any cool artwork or artwork ideas for me, for my channel or anything to do with it, just send them through. And uh, let's get on with the show. I realised I was like looking left and right all over there. Well, you got, you see, you got, you got your tea on your left. You got your phone on the right, which has got all the messages that I've wrote down on it. So let's get started. First question comes from the juice, the juicestas, the juicestas, the juicestas is what I'm calling you. Um, is Dota 2 coming back? Um, yes, I have said before, um, but I, I think I'm going to sort of explain a bit better. Um, Dota 2 will be back, but um, it won't be back until we get our series going on Mission of Realm. We're doing a series, me and Rage, we're co-commentating on a series we both created. Um, we're actually waiting on the animations for the show right now. Um, the guy who's actually been paid by Valve to do Valve's animation is working with us. How amazing is that? Um, for the intro of the show. So when that's actually done, we can do the show. We're all ready. We're just waiting for him to finish the animation, which takes ages. Um, as soon as that comes out, and that's airing on Machinima, obviously both of us will be saying, come over to our channels to watch more content. And to do that, we're going to need to make Dota content, both of us, for them to come over and actually watch. Otherwise, why would they come over to not watch more Dota content? So when the content's on Mission of Realm, each week or whatever, um, I'll be doing more Dota, Dota content for those subscribers to come have a look at, get used to us, like ask the style of the channel, and uh, hopefully watch some other stuff. So yeah, it'll be coming back. I can't give you a time, but that's the plan. It will be coming back. Little me 76 asks, How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck pineapple? What? Further Mucker asks, What prestige level are you? What? Omega Immortals, at least I can pronounce this one, uh, asks, Who is the best author and why? Obviously, I, it's my opinion who I enjoy the most. I've not read many books recently. I've just been reading The Inheritance Cycle. I've finished it now, and I'm so upset that I've finished it. I'm pretty sure I've mentioned it at some point. Um, and I want it to continue. But, uh, yeah, he is currently my favourite author. I'll, let me just have a look. Christopher Paylony. Paylon... Palahaha. I can't pronounce that. I'll put it on screen. Paylony is how I'm saying it. Um... He wrote the books that I've been reading that I've talked about before, where he wrote Inheritance, Eldest, Brisinger, and um, obviously Aragon, the one that started it. I think his writing style is really interesting, the world he created was amazing, and it's easily my favourite story or series, and I would fucking love for it to be made into films. It did get made into one film by like some shitty fucking director who's crap, and it needs to be and deserves the same level of Lord of the Rings. Trust no one except me. It's a good name, man. I like that name. Um, Ask me if I ever plan on streaming and my thoughts on streaming. I would love to stream. I've got really good ideas for it. Um, I've got, you know, I just I would enjoy doing it. But not many people watch it. To be honest, I think I'd be lucky if I got like a hundred viewers, if even that, on a stream at any time. Um, and when I'm doing it. That stream footage is probably going to be lower quality because I have I have to pay for the software to actually you know stream, um, which would suck because I'm not you know I'm not getting anything back from it apart from bringing content to you and fun I guess I'd only really do it for like one month I think Rage did that just for the sake of just doing it for you guys just did like one month like subscription and then did some streaming but after that 
there's not much we can really do because it, it costs money and not many people watch, you know? Um, I like the concept though. I'm actually wanting, I was going to be streaming via getting the fire cape, killing Jad on RuneScape, which would be fun for all the people who are interested in RuneScape. But unfortunately, I need that for my actual channel. So I'd have to be recording using Fraps, which actually, you know, wrecks your, your FPS. And also streaming re using the XSplit recorder or whatever I use, which would even lower the FPS then again lowering the content the sound content will be bad so you know I, I get around that by using xsplit and uploading the streaming content but i don't want to upload lower quality content which is what the stream would be so it's you know it's this terrible cycle so there's not much i can really do about it bibli1234 asks a question that i don't really like it's it's a dumb no offense man but it's not a very good question it's like it's, it's something that you, sh you shouldn't really need to ask but you know lots of people have asked questions like this similar to this so I may as well address it now he said he asked me is there any tension about you and rage being that he has a much bigger channel than you and you know we're both in a race to try and get big and the reason this is a stupid question is because rage is my friend like Josh is my friend and he started making content because I was just making stupid videos every other week out of boredom and I showed him how to do it but he didn't dick around and do it as a hobby he did it full fucking time he did one video every single day and poured his heart and soul into every video until he's at the point he is right now he's done one video every day for like three years and every video he's tried to make it entertaining or funny and that's impressive and I'm proud of him and it's it's a really good thing that he's done and I couldn't be happier for him because he's he's found something that he's really good at and that could be his career for the rest of his life and he's really doing well right now so why why would I be mad about that I don't understand anyone who would ever say that because I've just started properly doing it like he's been doing it for about like eight months nearly a year now why does that mean I have to be mad at him for doing well and making good content? That's just a good thing for me, really, because he's my friend and he'll help me out. So I hope that stems the tide of those retarded questions. Back to what to uh, recorder I used from Devin... I'm sorry. <laughs> De Devin, he's got a name I can pronounce, and then his last name is... Sva... Savrakis. Savrakis. Saragakis. Saragis. Saragis. His last name is Saragis, and if it isn't, I'm sorry. Oh god. <laughs> he asked what recorder I use, and I use Fraps. Um, that is to record my actual screen. I use that for everything that I record my screen with. Um, Fraps. Google it. Uh, I had to pay money for it. It's not free software. It's a good software, but it's obviously it's not free. Um, if you'd like to check any specs or anything or what you know I'm using to edit just go onto my channel It's at the right in the description of my channel a little explanation all my PC specs Everything is there everything to do with how I record basically last time I had a very majestic uh, Mug cup thing with a majestic horse on it from Iceland that I brought home and uh, Gubiak asked do you think Gubiak is majestic like the horse on that mug? Gubiak you're far, far more majestic. You're like, you're like a lion. You're like a lion, Gubiak. <laughs> Evans, because he's always on the show every week, every time, he's for every single, every single episode, asked, uh, "What do you think of the PS4? Like the release of it, the reveal of it, and meh, I guess. Like it's just the new console. It's gonna be worse than PC. Every console is worse than PC because they can't physically." do as good of a job as a PC because a PC's made for it. The only way simple answer is Hanny Slays uh, asked me uh, what did you want to be when you grew up and um, you know I'm not really sure what I wanted to be when I grew up. I mean I'm a kid I don't really remember that kind of s hang on there's, there's more to the question here. My sister wanted to be a tree A tree. A tree.
Blademan1127 asked uh, the final question of the episode, so uh, let's hope it's a good one, because it's the final one. He asked, Hey Hollow, I don't have a question. Welp. Aha! I remembered this time. Remember to leave all your questions in the comments down below on this video, because next time I come back to do the next episode, I'll always come onto this video here and scroll all the way to the bottom to see the first comment, start reading and, you know, copy-paste all the cool and interesting questions into my notepad, and uh, just start scrolling up. So, the sooner you get your question in, the more likely I'll see it, though I probably will see all of them because I go through all the comments, you know, just to check. So yeah, remember to leave your uh, questions at the bottom, uh, generationhollow at gmail.com for your artwork, and uh, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time.